Hey guys, so today I am doing my What I Got For Christmas 2021 video. A few things I wanted to say real quick. First off, I started posting on my Instagram again, so if you don't follow me on there, it's just the same as my like YouTube username, so it's just Hopeful Guru. Also, I am filming on this like super fancy camera that and my boyfriend Aaron bought. I used it the whole time, it takes like amazing pictures, and then it's sat in the closet ever since we got home in July. I thought I would try filming on it, so I want you guys to tell me what you think about the quality. Also, for Christmas, he got me a tripod for it, so that's like on the camera right now. This is the tripod, like the legs go out like that. That's the first thing. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, so next thing Aaron got me was a necklace, and it came with match earrings, and it's there. You can see how they're like roses. So pretty. I love, love, love this. Next, Erin got me some clothing items. So first is this black and blue, like, floral, kind of baby doll style shirt. I love this. It's so cute. It's so soft. And this blue is just gorgeous. Clothing stuff is from Amazon, by the way. Next, he got me this. This is so pretty. It's so vibrant. Really beautiful, bold blue. I don't know what this print is. All I know is it's beautiful. So, love this. It's so cute. I cannot wait to wear this. Last thing he got me for um, clothing. This red silky robe. It has a tie and then it has lace at the bottom. He also has it at the ends of the sleeves. You know me, my favorite color is red. It is freaking gorgeous. So I love this. Last thing he got me, I was so excited and would have never ever guessed that he was going to get me this. So on Black Friday, we went shopping and we went to Ulta. I had this gorgeous palette that I really wanted, but it was $60 and I like could not justify spending $60 on a makeup palette. Because I'm in college, I don't have a job, and by the way, I haven't gotten paid from YouTube in a while. I'm like not monetized anymore. So and it's a makeup store, so like I wasn't expecting that he was paying attention at all. And then I opened this on Christmas. It's Urban Decay Marvel Eternals palette. Oh my gosh, you guys, this palette is beautiful. Oh, packaging is amazing. It looks like this. It has a cool little pop-up. Then you pull it up and it has the eyeshadows. Oh, they are beautiful. Beautiful. This is the last thing I was expecting him to get me for Christmas. Literally obsessed with it. It's so pretty. I love this. So thank you, Erin. Yes, baby. No, he's not my husband. I just have his name in that on my phone. So cousin named Erin so she got me this cute little like bath set so little bath bomb it's, and this is a I love you too Erin this is a sugar plum fairy lotion stick so it's like this and you literally just twist it up and it's lotion like go like that you know rub it in a little bit and you're good like that's it this is cute. It's simple, easy. You could throw it in your purse. It doesn't take up like any space at all. So I lastly, she got me this beautiful soap bar, like marble. So excited. And it smells so good. But thank you, Erin and Liz and Uncle Sean. They gave me an Amazon gift card. So I love buying poetry books. I'm excited. I can get some new ones now. Last, I have the stuff from my mom, which is a lot. Basically on Black Friday, me and my mom go shopping. And I pick stuff out and then she wraps it for me and gives it to me for Christmas. Now we better get started. The rolls from Target. So this one is an emerald green with lace right here. This one is black with lace and it has a little bit of extra like crochet up here I think. Then we have the same thing but in white. So lace and extra crochet up here. So cute. Lastly, another emerald green but this one has like a really pretty floral pattern on it and then it has some extra lace here and a little bow there thank you madre he also got me car seat covers those are like on my cars and now we have a lot of clothing first is this sweater from target pretty like a red purple colored sweater i wanted to go buy this it's 20 bucks but on black friday it was on sale for 10 love this Next, see another Target sweater. This one is this really pretty lilac color. I'm really excited about this. It's so pretty. And these are so thick and soft. They're going to be so warm. Then I got um, this same style sweater in a couple different colors. This is the softest thing I have ever felt in my life. It has this cute little like detail right here. I'm just like a little 
seam sewn in right on the sides. So first I got the mint green one. Then of course I got a maroon, which is my favorite color ever. I got a beautiful lilac purple one. I love this. It's so pretty and I cannot get over how soft these are. Oh my gosh. And last one I got is this beautiful peachy coral. I seriously like don't own like anything pink. So this it's really pretty. I love this peachy coral color. It's like so unique. I don't know, but I really love this. So I'm excited about some new sweaters. And then this one, I was not with her. This one she surprised me with. So this is a gray, definitely like gray, white, and black salt and pepper sweater from Kohl's. This is so soft, you guys. Like this kind of like a knit material. So it's going to be so warm. I don't know what it is, but I love this so much. It's a thank you, mom. Okay, so that is everything from Target. I think the rest of the stuff is from Charlotte Russe. So I got a little pajama set. So it's just a little red crop top was blessed. And then it has matching pants that are black, red, and white. And say blessed again, like to go with the shirt. These are so, so soft. I, it's amazing. And it has a cute little red bow. So just a cute little pajama set. I don't have any like actual matching like top and bottom pajama sets. So... I was excited when I saw this. So when I saw this one on Black Friday, I was like, yes, I need that in my life. Next, I got this black, um, just buttons, like, all the way down. But I think this is going to be, like, really sexy on. So I'm excited to try this out. Um, then all of my tights have holes in them. Like, all of them. So first I got these um, just opaque black tights. And then I also got ones that are fleece lined, which are going to be so nice. Oh, these were five bucks. And Black Friday, they had like buy one, get one for a dollar or something. So that was a great deal. I wear them all the time because I wear dresses like all the time. So I'm really happy that I have new tights. I needed these. So thank you, mom. And now we have the mother load of pajama pants. First, I have these pink, black, and white plaid. So soft. Like, I get it. Like, it's... And they have a little bow to tie. Then I got these ones that are gray with little orange foxes. How cute are these? And then I got these white ones with little gray snowflakes. And these are so cute. They're so soft. Again, I just, I love these. I can't wait to wear these. And then next I got two pairs of joggers. These are high-rise joggers. These are just like a black and white tie-dye and then obviously they get tight at the bottom and they have a little uh, tie in the middle. And then I got this plain gray pair. These are boyfriend joggers. So they look like this. They're not really plain. They have like this cool, I don't know. It's almost like a salt and pepper, but I don't know. These are so cute though. I love these. And again, they're joggers so they get tight at the bottom. So those are all of the clothes. And my mom got me a bunch of candy. She got me a couple bags of these Hershey's Peppermint Bark Little Bells. And then she got me 10 boxes of a bunch of crunch because this is like my favorite candy in the world. I think I bought 8 boxes and they're all gone. So she got me 10 more. So thank you, mother. And next when we were at Ulta, I picked out a Morphe palette because they were on sale for like $13 or something crazy. So this is the 35F Fall Into Fabulous. And this is so cute. It says, blend the rules. How cute is that? So here is the actual palette. And here are the colors. So pretty. It has so many, like, warm toned shades. I love it. And I thought this was really cool. It came with this, um, little thing. So, like, each of the eyeshadows actually have, like, a name, like, printed on the thing. I have a couple Morphe palettes, and I love them. So I'm really excited that I have a new one. And then the last two things I have to show you are coloring books. Like my two things I love to do for like self-care. First is write quotes. Like I said, I like to buy poetry books. So basically I buy a poetry book and I just write down the quotes that are in it. Like in a notebook. I just, I don't know why, but I love reading it. And then I love writing the quotes just in a little notebook. So I love doing that. And then the other thing that I do is coloring. So she got me two coloring books from Michael's. So this one is just flowers, so it's really pretty. It has an hour and then it has like an inspiration picture on the side that like you could color it like that if you want to, but obviously you don't have to and I definitely won't. <laughs> I will do whatever, I just kind of do my own thing, but it literally tells you the, um, the type of flower at the bottom. That's sweet. 
So this is really pretty. Love this. And then next is this one. And look how cool this looks. So it says, Choose Joy, a coloring book of gratitude and wonder. So my two favorite things obviously are quotes, which quotes, poems, you know what I mean? So quotes and coloring. So coloring books that have quotes in them, it's like the best of both worlds. So I had to get this. So it changes the route, like some are quotes and some are Bible verses. Just cute little quotes. Here's like a Maya Angelou one. So I love these. I think they're just so cute and so fun. And I am so excited to have my hands on some new coloring books. Oh, last thing she got me. I posted on Instagram and asked you guys what your like number one thing on your Christmas wish list was. Mine was a essential oil like diffuser. My mom got me like a huge thing of essential oils for my birthday. And I don't have a diffuser, and I've always wanted one. So, my mom got me an essential oil diffuser. So, she got this from um, Bed Bath & Beyond, if you were wondering. So, it's just um, this brand spa room, and it's cool. It has, like, um, different, like, color settings. And I'm really excited, though, to finally have one of these because I can, like, leave it going even when I'm not in the room. Candles, you don't want to light and then, like, now be in the room and just leave it. So, I'm really excited to have this because... There's no flame, so I can just leave it going on like a candle. So I've wanted one of these for so long, so I am so excited that I finally have one. So that is it for my What I Got for Christmas 2021. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you had a very Merry Christmas. Subscribe again. Follow me on Instagram. It's just the same as my username. It's Hopeful Guru. And I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye. <laughs> My bra is showing. You know what? I'm going to put this away. I might as well keep it out. Honestly. Whoa. That made my lighting go crazy. And then. Okay. A little. There we go. This is. Did I say that right? Yeah. Oh, this is crushing. We crack it, girl. We crack it. Oh. Mm.